Now we are going to see multiple. Every multiple of a number is divisible by that number. Every multiple of a number is divisible by that number. For example, 50. 50 is the multiple of 10. I have already told you 10 into 5 is equal to 50. This is the multiplication table. 10 into 5 is equal to 50. But what is given? What is given? 50 is the multiple of 10. If you multiple 50 divided by 10, you can get 5. Again, 50 is divided by 5, you can get 10. So, this is the proper explanation of this sentence. 50 is the multiple of 10. So, 50 is divided by 5. That is what is given in the definition. Every multiple of a number is divisible by that number. If you multiple by 10, it will 10 into 5, you can get 50. 5 into 10, you can get 50. If you divide it, 50 is divided by 10, you can get 5. Again, 50 is divided by 5, you can get 10. So, that is what the proper explanation of multiple. Now, factor. Factor. A number when divides the other number without a reminder. That means, I am going to divide 24. 24 is divided by 6. What do you get? 6 table. You must say the 6 table. So, 6 ones are 6. 6 twos are 12. 6 threes are 18. 6 fours are 24. Okay. So, what is the answer? 6 into 4, you can get 24. I just want to tell you one thing. This is a, this is inside number. This is a outside number. So, this is a dividend, D-I-V-I-D-E-N-D, -D, dividend. This is a divisor. What do you call? Divisor, D-I-V-I-S-O-R, divisor. So, what is the answer? 6 into 4, you can get 24 children. So, 4 you must write on the top. It is called as quotient. Okay, 6 into 4, 24. You can get the final answer is 0. That is reminder. Okay, that is what is, that is what is given in the definition. Without a reminder means you will get the answer is 0. There is no number will come for the reminder. Okay, without a reminder then the number is called the factor of the first number. Then the number, then the number is called the factor of the first number. So, 24 is divided by 1, you can get 24. 24 is, I told you, 24 is the example. 20, if you divide it by 1, you can get 24. If you divide it by 2, you can get 12. If you divide it by 3, you can get 8. If you divide it by 4, you can get 6. If you divide it by 6, you can get 4. If you divide it by 8, you can get 3. If you divide it by 12, you can get 2. If you divide it by 24, you can get 1. So, these numbers, these numbers, that is 24, 12, 8, 6, everything, these are all called as a, what, factors, factors of 24.